And that's he's got to pick up. <laughs> that was the right distance. He's hit that out of the ground. That's another one. Goodness gracious me, that peppered the top. You see the chap climbing up there to have a look over the wall. 52 and 29 minutes. That's another one up in the enclosure. Three balls, three sixes. 58. What an incredible bit of hitting. Oh, he's got that shorter one. It's up again. There it is, bouncing on the, bouncing on the concrete. Four sixes in four balls. This makes him 64. Four sixes. Wonder where Nash is going to bowl this one. And that will just carry. Now he's going to be out. Caught out. Oh, he's got it. He's over the boundary. Six it is. Five on the trot. Oh, this is incredible. Now, this, 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 this is six on the trot's a world record. It's been done before, but uh, 70 on the board. And he's done it! He's done it! And my goodness, it's gone way down to Swansea. Six on the trot. 36 in one over. My goodness gracious, what an over. A few words exchanged between Yuvraj and uh, Flintoff. I wouldn't bother you, Vraj, if I was you. That's huge! That is a piggy, it's out of here! Ravi, I'm backing this one. I think this is one of the biggest. Into orbit. Even bringing smoke in the clouds, this. Off the bat, it's still in there, we've lost it. There it is again. That's a biggie. Keep going. Oh, I don't know how far this is. Well, 111, the longest. And this might just go the distance. I think those few words with Lintoff just charged him up a bit. Miss Barb O'Hack, 111 metres, he's in danger here. That was a magnificent strike. A crunching sound as the ball hit Willow. Now a man drops back to deep mid wicket. Third man comes up. Yuvraj has seen that. He's got a wide range of shots. What's he going to do? Six ball! Just a flick of the wrist. And away she goes into the crowd. Consecutive sixes here for the left-hander. Magnificent hitting this. You've right, we saw him on the boundary edge. Get me in. Just a flick, nothing more. Hard hat time. Look out in the crowd, he's coming again. Well, this was a new ball that was taken. The first one lying in a gutter, just at the back, on some road behind Kingsmead. Second one flicked into the crowd. Twenty-six from eight deliveries, you've Raj. He's not got his eye in yet. This is in the air again, clears long off, three in a row. Yuvraj going to broad what Mascarenas did to him at the Oval. Three of three. He's raining sixes here, Kingsmead, there's another. Look at the technique, right foot out of the way, full swing of the bat. Yuvraj, 32 from nine deliveries. Six, 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 and it's bully, bully, bully in the crowd. Absolute carnage.
now around the wicket. Will it make a difference? It doesn't. It's four in a row. 24 of the first four balls. Here it is again. You've right Singh. 38 from 10 deliveries. Four sixes in a row. England are having a conference meeting. They're in bits. Well, he's got the license here to go for the full Monty. Six out of six. Well, this is a pressure ball for Broad if this goes out of the ground. And that team meeting might be just extended a little bit more, David. Eight deliveries to go. It's 195 for three. We talked, speculated on 200. They're way past 200. Yes, it's because of this gigantic over. Still not completed. Back to over the wicket. It's a scrambled brain as far as Broad is con concerned out there. This is a crowd warning. Look out. Five. Yes. Thirty. With one ball to go. Could he make it six out of six? Well, it's short time here. Would you believe this? Clean as you like. Here he goes again. You've right, Singh. 44, 11 deliveries. It's up there somewhere. Yes, we saw Herschel Gibbs doing it in a game against Holland in the World Cup. Now, it's never happened in TT cricket that five have disappeared. There's every chance now. Yuvraj must be favourite here to put the sixth one into the crowd as well. Kingsmead on its feet. So is the commentary box. And here goes Broad. Last ball of the innings. And he's put it away. Oh, has he? Yes, into the crowd. Six sixes in an over. Yuvraj Singh finishes things off in style. The first time it's happened in 2020. Still one ball, one over to go. Get out of here, you right Singh. Look at that. India, as one man, stood together. I don't believe it. I've seen hitting not like this. Massive, absolutely massive. Forget them two, it's all about him. You right Singh, 50, 12 deliveries. You're kidding me. Terrific effort, this. That's the second. Number three, long off. Number four, backward point. It's every part of the ground. This one, over square leg. And this is the last one. To make it 36 in that over. That's the full Monty. is a great cricket shot and he's in fact have gone out the ground down the wicket beautifully timed by Herschel Gibbs <laughs> that's great to watch that well if you're not bowling Herschel Gibbs 38 off 31 balls now starting to open up liking the look of these short straight boundaries here at Warners Park so fifth six for the South Africans still plenty more to come and they found it there was a moment where we were thinking we might call for the ball bag but someone at the back behind the main stand has managed to pick it up the shortest probably will be the shortest boundary in this World Cup it's only 66 yards from the middle of the pitch Gibbs goes again consecutive sixes to Herschel Gibbs the remarkable shots there. Fair to say he's opening his shoulders a fair bit. That's what makes him so good to watch. What's he going to follow it up with? Goes again. What is on the go yet? That's three in a row. Daryl, I'm going to call for the helmet. That's nearly knocked us guys up here at the commentary box. That was the off spinner there. 
Hibbs acknowledges an excellent 50. Quick pace of 33 balls, including four sixes. Starting to launch. Flattered. Spin there. Still good enough to get under it. Make that four. It's gone even further. Don't worry about the short boundaries. Not big enough to Herschel Gibbs. All the way, four consecutive sixes this over. Just keep going, Herschel. Great shot of it again. No catches in the crowd there. Aren't the crowd enjoying it? Herschel Gibbs. Superb stuff. Teammates are loving it. What do you do? Do you go the maximum? He's got to keep going. He's got to go for six. Will it be five? You bet on it. That's five in a row to Gibbs. <laughs> Superb stuff. Saw it was short, thought he was in trouble, and just bangs it straight again. Just over left field there, it's baseball. So Gibbs with the opportunity to hit six, sixes in an over. Where is it? Where is it? Six in a row. And one can safely say that is the first in the history of the World Cup. And is it the first I think in the history of one-day cricket? In one-day cricket. I think Gary Sobers and Ravi Shastri have done it in first-class cricket. Sensational. And this is the last one. Half tracker, Gibbs, baseball like, smashes it over the boundary and look at the elation these teammates are making. Wouldn't you? Sensational stuff, Herschel Gibbs. Has this got South Africa's World Cup campaign going in a big way? The unusual cricketer has the ability to do something really special. What I love is when Newey is always going to go for it because he's that type of personality, infectious character. He's just enlightened this World Cup. What about that young man there? Not at the end of the spell. We'll see that for many a time to come. We've got a million dollar man today. It's Herschel Gibbs and Daryl Cullinan is with him. Herschel, you've done, you've done a few special things in your career. Where does that rank? Yeah, I think there's uh, up there with the best. Um, never, uh, you know, would have thought of, of getting six in a row. But um, you know, as it uh, these things go, if it's your day, it's your day. So uh, lucky enough, you know, the field's quite small too, which helped a little bit. So uh, I was quite happy to take it. <laughs> At what stage did you think that it was truly on? Were you just playing it ball by ball? Yeah, definitely. I um, after the first three, I thought, well, um, I may be in with a chance. You know, I hit the I hit the fourth one. Um, and I decided. I'm not actually going to charge him, I'm just rather just wait, wait um, in my crease and uh, decide what he, you know, see what he does. So, and let, as I said, just fell into the, to the right spot. That's the Callisto's 100. It's brilliant to play at innings. And for that team's time today, you know, the boundary to one of the Savigan batsmen. Do you know there's a little twist to this whole thing? It was a million dollars up for grabs to charity. Yeah, look, I mean, that is that is a bonus, you know. It would have been nice to maybe uh, maybe get maybe $2 of it. But, um, no, look, I mean, the charity is obviously more important. And, um, you know, I just, you know, it was just a little bonus and uh, obviously, you know, runs for the team, which which matters in the end. So, um, yeah, it was just nice enough to be out there in the middle again and get a, a chance to bat. It's been fairly quiet for you recently. What does it actually mean for you, though, in terms of really getting yourself going and having a great World Cup? It's been a little bit frustrating over the last few months. Um, you know, the guys at the top of the order back home, especially, um, you know, batted really well and gave you know, the little the middle order quite a little chance to get in the in, in the middle. But um, yeah, it's it's obviously nice to have got runs. Um, we've got another big game, or you know, this is obviously a big game, two, three big games, and um, yeah, it's just you know, any little time in the middle definitely does help. You know. Herschel, congratulations! Thanks for the great entertainment and. Uh, Perhaps a quiet word with Johnny Walker might do. Why get on like a homesick mole? Thanks, mate. Okay, thanks, Al. <laughs>
<coughs> Herschel Gibbs, who hit six sixes off and over today. And over that Herschel will never forget. Neither will Dan von Bunga. The bowler who was on the wrong end of them. Some rasping stroke play. It's a heck of a good stop too. So just to, to complete the sort of details of the whole Herschel Gibbs thing, that Johnny Walker, who were part of the sponsorship for this World Cup, are giving a million dollars to charity to a man who hits six sixes in and over. Suppose they weren't really expecting it to happen. He gets it there by some distance. Kyron Pollard. Power of this man, Pollard. Initially, it looked as though he missed hit it. He's cleared the boundary quite easily. Gone with the wind. No doubt about that one. It's a six hitting festival either side of the three wickets, the four wickets that have fallen. Second six for Follard. I think that was the break. Second six for Follard in as many deliveries. This one straight down the ground. Two full from Dananjaya on this occasion. And West Indies will have to balance the six hitting with judicious batting. He goes again. Three in three for the West Indies captain. A bemused look on the face of Dananjaya. Captain Angelo Matthews going to offer some suggestions to Akila Dananjaya. But it's a hat trick of sixes for Kieran Pollard. We saw it firstly by Evan Lewis. And no, for Cameron Pollard. To get the length right is the key thing here for Dananjaya. We've seen the leg break and the googly. He's had problems with his bowling action in 2019. He was out of the game for a year, having debuted in 2012 in the World Cup in Sri Lanka. Can he get the length right? No, he can't. Make it a dose of four for Kyron Pollard. Unbelievable hitting by Baker and Pollard. Still too full. Still way too full from the Najaya. Four six for Kyron Pollard in four deliveries. A bit of a counter attack by the West Indies captain. This point that Bishop Gibbs and Warner Parkinson kits with six sixes and over. You've read Singh in South Africa, Stuart Broad, six sixes, not calling for it. They're saying it's on the horizon. Length too full. Don't think he got all of that one. Definitely got all of that. There's a little bit of speed on it as well. And this is where he's improved his offside game, Pollard. This ground isn't big enough if he middles it. Even if he doesn't middle it, Bish. Sometimes didn't middle the first one. Sometimes. <laughs> it's 
nine sixes already hit by the West Indies. They've lost four wickets, but they've already hit nine sixes. Matthews almost directly behind the bowler. Oh, goodness. Five sixes. And all of a sudden, Herschel Gibbs and Yuvrat Singh start jogging your memory. Can Pollard make it six from six? Whoa. A massive hit from Kyron Pollard. Five sixes in five balls. Can he make it six? Going round the wicket. Six sixes for Kyron Pollard. Herschel Gibbs, you brought saying you have company. And a little bow to the waving gallery of his teammates for the West Indies captain. 98 for four. way and that just turns the keeper off once in a while when you expect uh, the batsman to be going big and then all of a sudden it just jabs his bat down and I think the keeper had gotten up a bit saying oh gosh well, this is going to disappear tough job keeping better you than me <laughs> there we go in the arc and that will go all the way again that's a Hazratullah's go-to shot didn't again for me catch it 100% but still the strength of that shot Taking it over the boundary line for a fog spagiza. Abdullah Mazari's first ball of the Gulbahar Afghanistan Premier League. And he goes the journey. And again. And that's even further. Oh dear, welcome to the bowling crease. Well, finally, Hazrat hitting the middle of the bat, the sweet spot. And yes, Mazari, welcome to the Gulbahar Afghanistan Premier League. That's what's going to happen. He's got a crabby kind of action, darted it in. But it was in the arc and Hazratullah, well, he just said, I'm going to take hold of this by the scruff of the neck. Terrific shot. It's down the leg side. Quite unusual there, actually, a wide signal. First two balls, he went to the side of the umpire. Now he's decided to go between the umpire and the stumps. Change of uh, angle in his approach. Six more. Oh, goodness me. Unbelievable hitting. They've all gone in roughly the same area. And uh, Mazari won't forget his uh, APL debut in a hurry. Well, so Kabul doing to Balk what Balk did to them. I think that just about stayed inside the stadium, so a ball saved. Now, six, six, wide six. Remember, Balk took 33 of one, 32 of another. We got uh, 19 now, two balls to go, three balls to go, beg your pardon. Of course, he now goes over the wicket. And should get the same treatment up in the air, this time on the offside, not cover there, over long off. Wow, Hazratullah Zazai, this is what we expected of you. Thanks for delivering so far. They couldn't, could they? Two, uh, 245, they're chasing. They made a flying start. Goodness me! You just wouldn't believe it, would you? Well, almost hit the cameraman high up on the deep mid wicket side, just to his left. Lucky that he's okay. 
But the ball's out of the park, so uh, the ball box will come on in. And Mohamed Nabi might be chewing that gum a little harder right now, saying, uh oh, hang on now. Uh, are we going to be chased? 245? No. Hazratullah, 50 in only 12 deliveries. There has to be some kind of a major record here. Hazratullah Zazai, fabulous innings. While we were just admiring the sixes, he's gone to 50. Brian's going to check this for sure. Only 12 deliveries. And up again into the night sky. He's done it. Six sixes in the over. Welcome to T20 cricket. Mazari can only smile. Had been taken apart. This is history. And Hazratullah Zazai has joined a very select band. Oh, goodness me. I feel really privileged to have been here. Hales oh. goes strong down the ground, and wow, he's admired that. Oh, that's a big hit. Right into his arm, and smashed for six. Well, that's nearly reached the pub. That's a huge hit. Right in the slot. Now, there's a bat swing. That's a golf swing. Well, I reckon 2020 batting is becoming more like golf in terms of the swing, the dynamics, the biomechanics required. Flipped away, leg side is number two. Well, that's just the pace on the ball. 50 for Hales off 33 balls. And because of the pace, he can just use it and flick that right hand at the ball. You don't have to worry about the bats these days. You don't have to worry about it not going. Just gets under the ball and flicks it. Rankin brought into the attack to try and take wickets for the Birmingham Bears, but Hales has counter-punched brilliantly. Two majestic sixes. 50 unbeaten off 33. Three maximums now and four fours. And the target is just 46. Goes again, that's bigger still. That's way back, brings up the 100 in spectacular style. Well, the Mumbai Indians will be watching this and thinking, get over here quickly. Again, it's just that pickup of length. That's all it is. That right hand takes over, it goes miles into the stands. seeing this lad in an England jersey soon he'll get a good run in the one day side and used to say he won't end up in the test side either goes again as he got the hash five in five well I reckon this is the best of the lot and straight you can see what Jarvis is trying to do just restrict him with a real full wall deep in the crease there's no right for that ball to go for six this is extraordinary there's shield on the front he's enjoying it <laughs> what's he going to be writing about tomorrow Ooh. Well, that's one way of stopping him hitting the six Where's he going? Where's he going now? Oh, he's giving it a go! He's got it! Six sixes! <laughs> well, this is remarkable. Power, oh, this only just goes over the road because of the quicker option. Well, the captain and bowler are having a chat. What on earth sure what they're going to do about this? This is absolutely brutal.